Hello everyone and welcome. I'm Glory Kiv and in today's video, well, we've got some new sniper rifles. Well, new to me at least. I haven't uh, picked up Battlefield 1 in about six months. So when I came back from university and I found a lovely 10 gigabyte update to do for Battlefield, I was a little bit shocked to say the least, but there has been so much new content that has been added into this game in the past couple of months and they've been I mean DICE has been doing some good work with this one uh, the maps I I can't really say that I enjoy them too much but I would say that the guns being there really adds a whole lot more variety we've finally got it to the stage where Battlefield 1 has like a list of guns that you kind of work through um, when you're like choosing what your class is you know normally when the game first came out look <laughs> i think even the assault class had like maybe 10 guns in total and they were all just different variants but now that we've got so many varieties so many variants it's actually very refreshing to have that and um i've uh, i've picked up the ross uh on the infantry version which is i'm pretty sure just you get automatically when you've got the dlcs and premium or something like that or i think maybe everyone in general gets it for free i'm not sure but uh I, uh, I, w I wanted to do some sniping with that, and so that's what I did. This was actually my very first game back after coming from uni, and I have to say, uh, I think my sniper shot is kind of still there. There's, you know, a good couple of shots where I'll miss here and there, uh, or I'll be a bit slow and not really track the enemy as well, but generally, I think I'm making the right choices, and I'm, you know, poking in and out and... Uh, I'm not overextending too much. I'm still not going too far out, which is good because that's what I do when I'm playing very aggressively, when I know I've got a good sniper shot at that point in time where I'm kind of feeling it. Uh, that's when I'll play very aggressive and I'll actually be a sniper, but I'll be the one person on my team who's the furthest towards the enemy. You know, I'm the one leading the charge and I'm sitting there with a sniper rifle. So uh, that's when I feel very confident with myself. But right now, you know, first game back, I wasn't feeling too confident. I was like, let's just stay inside some buildings and creepy holes and just pop off some shots at kids. And uh, it turned out pretty good. I was very happy with that. Uh, definitely my speed has been affected. Uh, I'm quite a lot slower than what I am when I'm kind of in form I guess you could say <laughs> so uh, yeah uh, but I just wanted to say that I am back and I have been uh, playing a little bit trying to get some gameplays uh, recorded because I was away at uni for so long and it was pretty much almost six months and I did try to keep those uploads going for as long as I possibly could and I was very happy with uh, how things were progressing at one point. I was almost being regular with uploading which was very surprising uh, so that was good and unfortunately towards the end I had exams and everything and then after that I realized I had pretty much run out of gameplay and I didn't want to show off any clips uh, because my glory introducing has been released and so if you guys want to check that out go ahead and uh, head over to the glory team page I'll leave a link in the description uh, if you haven't already subscribed to them and uh, I hope you guys enjoy it uh, I feel as if it was a great job by Tugger he made some great transitions and music um, really suited the clips re quite well and I feel as if he kind of did some syncing that really made it um, its own so yeah that was awesome and uh, thanks Tugger you're the best <laughs> but for those of you who have not subscribed to glory I will be uploading my introducing on my own channel uh, in the future as well so stay tuned for that and I'll catch you guys all on the next video I've been Glory Kiv and I'll see you next time